What's good YouTube? It's Jason back here with another video. I'm here in Mississauga and the reason why I'm here is because I'm doing a podcast with a local group from Mississauga. Their names are Nick and Cal. They also have a third member named Mike but I don't think he's going to be on the podcast. Oh, he is. They're all funny yeah. and it's going to be a very interesting podcast because these guys don't have a specific topic. <laughs> they just like to talk whatever they like. So this, this is Cal. Khaled right here. Good to meet guys. you. Nice to meet you, bro. How you been, man? Good, Jason, good. welcome, it's welcome a, to Auto Talk, man. It's a bit bright out here, so that light. I ain't complaining. Some good weather, man. A great looking Somalian. Thank you, man. Thank you. <laughs> hey, yo, nine to five. What's going on, man? This is man? Nick. Jason, buddy. How you been, man? man? This is Mike. Good, man. <laughs> the infamous Mike. If you watch his podcast, yeah. they have about 39 episodes right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. they're really. The 40, 40 first? Yeah, 41st? 41st, I feel like. On point. I don't think I've ever used that number in my life. 41st. The reason why is because I've been keeping up with the YouTube channel and all the you know the episodes and we're gonna talk more about it on the podcast because right, it's very interesting. You're Arab, right? Mike, uh, no, no, I'm Canadian, bro. Uh. Hey, hey, you know what? I'm the, I'm the, you know, you know what? Bro, you, there's gotta enough, with, you gotta run with that now. There's enough, no, there's enough people that, 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 that make that Jerk mistake. Because he thinks he's African, so the fact that he's, <laughs> he's actually from Ghana, bro. <laughs> That's the joke. Well, the reason why I say that is because you made a, uh, a joke on an episode yeah. where Arabs don't pronounce P. Yeah. Yeah, so they're not yeah. pushing P. Pushing the sweet spot yeah. to win a free Biza right. Biza. Yeah. Right. Why do Arab guys always go Biza Biza? Biza Biza. Because P is not a letter in Arabic. <laughs> really? Yeah. Are you serious? I'm so dead ass. That's, yeah. so that's why. Yeah. yeah. Biza, so Biza. There you go. It's a quick answer for you. Wait, P is not a letter in Arabic? Arabic. Yeah, P. No. I just say so, B, the, so Arab men can't be pushing P then? <laughs> what? We push him back. He's <laughs> <laughs> grown up in Mississauga his whole life. He eats too many shawarmas. That's, That's his problem. Man. You know those late night Laziz runs? Oh. Got him, you know, a little bit. You know, you know yeah. he's got a, a little cultured. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know got why? Cultured. Yeah. Get away from Laziz the over Osmos. <laughs> right. We're going to talk more about that because that's a local Mississauga team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, know? Yeah, you know, you know. If, if you, you know, know, you know. It's a very interesting podcast because we have so much relate relatable things to talk about. These guys don't know yet, but we're going to talk about it in the podcast. Yeah. Okay. You got, be, you got something for us? Yo, it's gonna kind of be like a bit trippy because yeah, it's a yeah. bit nostalgic. Right. Small world. Right, right. Absolutely. I, I got some topics ready, some local topics so that you guys, if you run out of ideas, we're gonna see who the real saga man is, eh, today. I've been thinking about this for two months now. Yeah. yeah. These guys are like one of the few local podcasts that I've seen in Mississauga, and they got a really good setup. You gotta keep it simple, right? 100%, man. Shout so, out to Nick, man. He's really the one that put this thing yeah. together, man. Welcome to the, the little bungalow we got going on here. Ooh. Brother. Whoa, whoa, this is dope. We got the green screen. Behind the scenes, this is official. Wow. We don't really do much BTS, but you know. That's it, man. I mean, when you got a vlogger here, you gotta. Yeah, yeah, you got him, right? This is a vibe, man. This is a vibe right here, man. You know? This is like a really cool setup. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Man, we actually, simple. we just put this one up today because we realized the last episode we had four people. That's pretty much it, man. We got the icebreakers ready to go. Ooh, I love those mics. Mandatory, bro. We're gonna have a lot of fun, dude. Yeah, man. Yeah. We're excited to hang out with you today, too, man. Me too. Mysterious, dude. This is our number Yo, one Jason, supporter. Jason, our number one supporter, man. You know, like the love is just <laughs> out of this world, man. Thank you for, you know, always, you know, appreciate it. On our content, you know. Always. Just love, you know, local, local content creators, bro. Do something good for the city. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Oh, have fun with it, man. Before we get started, I love to shoot B-roll. The reason why I want to come on this podcast is because of the guests and also the production. The production is what makes podcasts more better and the consistency. If you're a creative, a content creator, you gotta be consistent with what you do or else you're just gonna be stagnant and you can't really go forward with anything. <laughs> The podcast just ended. <laughs> this is episode 42. They have two more episodes before the one that I am on. It was a two hour podcast. It felt like a movie. You're literally watching a movie full of laughs, full of conversation. We got into conspiracy theories. We got into Square One, Mississauga, Brampton. We got into cultures everywhere, like what people did. Everything, childhood. Nick? 
That's Thank you funny. again for hooking this up. Took two months to do yeah, it. Yeah, I know. Because of this guy right here. Because of Cal. So, Cal, hey. shout out to you. Well, yeah. first of all, thank you again. Thanks for coming, man. That was fun. Yes, bro. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. Appreciate it. You brought the vibes, man. Appreciate thank it. Thank you, that, Mike. Brother. It was fun. My Arab buddy. <laughs> yeah. The whitest Arab you know. Yeah, I was saying on the podcast, <laughs> yeah. he looks like Johnny Sins with hair. <laughs> Why are you guys doing that? We're like gonna that? have to Photoshop <laughs> it, bro, with the, yeah, that. bro. We gotta Photoshop you making ball, bro. <laughs> we had a debate about pizzas between Domino's and Little Caesars. This guy daps me up, <laughs> thinking that he agrees with Little Caesars and says, I disagree. Yeah, bro. I can't <laughs> like, what? Hanging, like, what? Like, what? Yeah. Can't leave, my <laughs> yeah. Can't leave him hanging. I'm sending you into the situation. Bro, over I'm like, you, bro. The United Nations, man. For yeah, real. but. Who we'll rectify any situation, bro? But honestly, yeah. though, you could have been like, respectfully, I disagree. Bro, but your your hand was out, bro. Am I gonna leave it hanging? I mean, you could you could be the villain. I've never been the type to be a villain, bro. Cap, bro. Bro. is a good guy. <laughs> yeah. Somali stereotypes, right? Yeah, bro. You're like the captain now of this yes, podcast. Yes, man. Right. We're taking over. <laughs> That's we, it. We handed off the reins to you though today, bro. Yeah. You're the captain of this ship. Today, I appreciate bro. it, man. I have to let you know, bro. It was fluid. It was nice, man, bro. Oh, it was. It was, it was just a vibe the whole time, man. Pretty long, right? Like, like, dude, I had so much yeah. content we didn't even get to. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta do a part two then, because there's a few things. That I didn't even get to. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's not even that's not even a question, man. That's gonna Sequel. happen. And it's gonna be another two hour one. Yeah. We might even get to Bollywood levels and give it three hours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's see if my editing is up there. Yeah. <laughs> you guys could check them out on Instagram, Huddle Talk TV, TikTok, Huddle Talk TV as well, YouTube, Huddle Talk TV, everything's uniform, just like myself. They have 40 episodes of content, so much funny clips on TikTok if you if you just want to scroll through. Check them out. They're hilarious guys. Local guys from Mississippi. I always gotta show support. They're on the come up. How many subscribers do you have? Almost, well, 900, let's say a thousand. Close to a thousand. On Yo, that's amazing. Almost 50K. Yeah. But yeah. Almost 50K on TikTok, you know? Woo! We're making our ways, man. We're still small. Yo, players. and this is gonna be a good collaboration, yeah. sir. Humble beginnings, man. Only up from here. Yeah. <laughs> you, you gotta film this guy. The manner is Only up from here. <laughs> like. And subscribe to the channel, man. Yeah, yeah. Turn on, turn on that bell. Turn on that notification. Mike, you got anything last words? Bro, we we appreciate the support. We appreciate the love. We loved having you come through, man. It's been a blast. It's been amazing. It's been a blast. Honestly, All right. Honestly, man. That's I'll it. Talk TV. We out, baby. It's been about four days now since that last podcast with Cal, Nick, and Mike. That was a great podcast with the Huddle Talk crew. I'm now at another local podcast I'm going to be doing with someone named Gary Clue. He's a NASCAR driver. Get to know him a bit more. The podcast is really cool because the production of it is amazing. Very professional. It's very simple. Nothing too much to it. The last video you watched was with Glenn Oral Farm. That's a very cool video. And if you haven't checked out also the video I did, the free concert with Dead Mouse and Bun B and Gumball 3000. That was a really cool one. <laughs> it's good, Gary. Are you expecting me to vlog? No, no. Come good. on in though. This is a great yeah, place. Yeah, show you the showroom. This is called Legendary Motorsport Company. Legendary Motor Car Company. Okay, dope. And yeah. as you can see, all around here is vintage cars. There's You've a... never been here before? No, never heard this of it. Like uh, 20 minutes from here. Yeah. So this is the uh, this is the showroom. Pretty much everything in here is uh, is for sale. Wow. Really? Yeah. Built this building in 2002. This yeah. is really cool. And, and how many cars would you say you have for sale here? We probably have about 100 cars for sale at a time. Wow. Man, everything from like 1909 steam car all the way up to modern supercars. This yeah. is amazing. Yeah. And I'm excited for this podcast. Yeah, it'll be good, man. Here with Gary's filmer, Mitch. This is like the little bunker, you call it. I'm not 100% sure what exactly goes in here. I think it's mostly cars that aren't ready for the showroom, as well as storage for customer cars over the winter if they don't have a, a good dry place to store it for the winter and they want to preserve it, right? And then this is like the lower section and these are some of the cars around here, like very old vintage cars. There's muscle cars. How old are these cars roughly? Ooh, man, it, it varies. This is definitely something I would say the 70s, at most the, the 40s or 50s because you still got these, these fins on it, right? You want to see what's upstairs? Sure. Corvette, this one's... Mustang, Those were rental cars. You could rent a race car back in the 1960s. It was pretty, pretty legit. Yeah, it's pretty surreal when you first start working here. I did work for like just normal Honda dealerships and stuff like that. Yeah. Found my way over here and okay, this is this is not the world of Civics anymore. Yeah. And this is a Rolls Royce in the back. Oh yeah. Another secret showroom you have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never seen so many like cars in one spot before. No, it's cool. Like even look this car. What kind of car is this? 
That's a Daytona Coupe. Shelby Daytona Coupe. Ooh, so, Shelby race, Drive. Race car, yeah. <laughs> you got the old little gas stations, the fuel up. Gas is expensive, by the way. Yeah, studio's in here. Oh, this is the, this is where the magic, wow. Come on in. This is absolutely dope. You got the lights here. You got the whole setup with the chairs. You got the little screens to block the lighting. Yeah, got the little on air sign. That's really cool, man. That'll be good. Looking forward to it. Me too. Yeah. Let's get a move on. Podcast just ended with Gary. A really fun podcast. We talked about a lot of different things like past history, work wise, social media, random topics, but fun conversations. I enjoyed it a lot. I'm definitely excited for this podcast. Half and half of business, but also fun talk that you just talk to people with. Gary, what did you think of that podcast? That was good. Glad to have you on. You're my first pop culture internet type guy. It was good to chat. Learned a bit of new things. Learned a lot. Like, I've got to fire up my own Instagram account for the podcast. Perhaps. Yes. Thanks for the tips. You're welcome. Even link up for the Toronto Indy. Yeah, dude, come out to the Toronto Indy. For sure, you can like the NASCAR deal, you can walk right up to the pit. You'll get a lot of cool shots. Let me know when that is. I would definitely want to hit you up and experience that and film all of that. Yes, sir, July 15th, we'll be cruising down Lakeshore at 270 kilometers an hour. Wow, amazing. 